Hello everybody, my name is Caretaker and I'm back again with another episode of Don't Starve. I know I usually go to the main menu, but I'm really excited to play this world. We have what it takes to survive the winter, but we were very desperately low on wood. Oh, look at that. See? Perfect. Alright, now I told you I wanted to find a winter coelophant. A winter one. Because a winter coelophant will give you... Can this increase my sanity? It does. Good. It'll keep me warm too. Keep the top hat for now, though. A winter one actually gives you more warmth. It's better insulation. Plus, I got my beard going, so I'm all set there. And I'm already lost. Really, dude? So the animal track is this way. I don't know. I really hope it is, because I lost it last time. Is it hidden in the trees? I really hope not. Right, it said it's this way. Where in the world? Okay, did I lose it again? Come on. It must be hidden in the trees or something. <sighs> Is the track gone? Why does it keep running from me? I've never had one do that before. They spawn a lot, so that's not really what I'm worried about, but damn. Whatever. I need to focus on getting logs right now because fuel does not last as long in the winter. Not to mention, I just need logs for a meat effigy in general, so. We need at least 16 logs for a meat effigy. You need four meat, four beard hair, and four. What's the word I'm looking for? Boards. Yes, boards. So I actually should have been doing this earlier. This is a mistake on my part. If you have a shovel, you can actually uproot them, which I'm actually going to do. Because it saves durability and uprooting trees, I believe, does not upset tree guards, which are always random. I've killed a few in my other worlds, but you definitely want to have an ice staff. They're not too, too hard to kill, but they will drain your sanity and it takes over 40 hits to kill one, so. And as you can see, it gets dark and you lose sanity really fast. So I'm actually going to switch over to my winter hat now. Looks like I'm freezing, so I'm actually going to use my ear muffs. My rabbit muffs. Do -do -do. Okay, with 20, you should have enough for a meat effigy as well as some boards for the night. So it's all depending on what you prefer. What would you like to have for the night? You want some warmth for a little bit longer or whatever. I could make a tent, which improves sanity and other things. But it's the cost of health. I do have meatballs. My health is my san my my hunger level isn't too too low. So I think we could risk it if I can find the materials. Let's see. Those aren't gonna grow. Unfortunately, those aren't gonna grow. I can harvest that with literally no problems now. So let's do this. I'm feeling frisky, so I'm gonna go ahead and go for it. It's a bit of a risk. It is a bit of a risk. I probably should have waited to do that, but whatever. I'm excited. I want to make my meat effigy. Okay, hopefully we don't nom on those. I'm actually going to make some honeyed ham. Also, food will go bad slower. And as you can see, they will not attack during the winter, so it's a good time to gather them. I'm not going to cook it just yet, either. I'm actually going to... See that stuff. Let's see. What am I missing? I need beard hair. Oh yes. Uh, it's kind of risky considering my beard hair will keep me insulated for the winter, but I do have a winter hat, and I'm sure I can probably kill a coelophant for a breezy vest. So I'm gonna go ahead and risk it, just in case. And see, lots of beard hair. If you do one tier lower though, you don't get as much beard hair. I think it should be eight. All right, and that means we can make our meat effigy. We can also make a pan flute once we get some papyrus, and that thing is amazing, so. I'm just gonna put my meat effigy right over here. And as you can see, when I do this, I lose 20 health. You will go down to a maximum health, no, 30 health. You'll go down to a maximum health of 20 health, of 130 health, or 120. I Ignore me, I'm being an idiot right now. 
All right, and as you can see, fuel will not last as long. I don't want to waste these. I'm going to wait till I get some of these. I need to make a new helmet because, as you can see, the durability is getting kind of low. I also need to... Right now, farming trees is my number one priority, as well as trying to find a quail elephant. Also, these winter guys, they don't do anything special. I thought they might give rat, they, uh, they might give rabbit tufts, but they don't. You actually have to kill bunny men. So. Did I put them too close? Shit, I think I put them too close. Ah, whatever, they'll be fine. I kind of want to make it a turbo farm, but I don't make a turbo farm just yet. If they come over here and keep farming me silk and stuff, I will not complain. I will not complain one fucking bit. Okay, give me a straw roll for a tent. Very tempting. In fact, I'm going to do that and make a bug net as well. And this is good. Tents have five uses, I believe. Mm -hmm. And prototyping increases your sanity, and this will give you 50 sanity every time you use it. It's got five uses, but it'll take a huge toll on your hunger. I think it drops 70 hunger overnight, but it will burn through a night as soon as you sleep in it. So if I'm on day 21 and I want to skip ahead and just get past the winter, I could jump in there, start of the day, and skip a whole day. But I don't want to do that, because I got farming to do. I'm going to drop my silk here. Oh. See, I'm, I'm already full? Damn. That's crazy as hell. Alright, it's not too, too cold, so it should be okay. I'm gonna keep using my rabbit ear muffs until it gets too cold and I start freezing. Then I'm gonna swap over my winter hat. I have no blue gem, which is what you need. But if some hounds attack me, I should be able to make a a vest. What am I saying? Is it a yeah, the log suit. I kinda wanna make a dapper vest, but unfortunately I do not have the means to do so. Oh good, I'll take that pine cone. Now, another good thing you could do in the winter is run around and try and find a what's it called a elephant track and just follow it unfortunately the ones i have found are in this godforsaken forest surrounded by spiders which i actually have another spider egg so i should actually use that later i'm not gonna put them in the same area oh that scared the crap out of me luckily they're easy to pacify too i don't think a sleep dart actually works on them blow darts work well on them because it does 100 damage a pop so you just walk away and just and shoot the crap out of it However, the, like I said, the best item is the ice staff. Using a fire staff on it is not smart because it will kill the living logs. If you don't really care for the living logs and you don't need a shadow manipulator just yet, which I don't really need, and I had a fire staff, I could easily walk up, blast it, burn it to death, and go on about my business. But we don't want to do that just yet. Living logs are only used for shadow manipulators, and there's nothing else they can be used for. If I were to bust down that thing's house, that pig's house... I would be set because I only have five for work on this. Ah, it does. Awesome. I'm actually going to take this monster me because I can see it is going stale. I'm going to use that to create rot. Those are green. If you find blue mushrooms, those are good too because they restore health and hunger, but you take a sanity hit. So if you know there's a way you can easily get sanity back, it might be good to go ahead and take the sanity hit just so you can have a little bit of extra health on the side. Alright, winter is quickly approaching. I say winter. Night is quickly approaching. It's always dark in the winter time, which is kind of crazy. But you don't take a sanity loss. So, and as you can see, I am now on the stage two. I should make a fire or burn something down, but I don't want to burn this forest down because I need this wood desperately. I might burn some twigs or something. Luckily, the winter hat will keep me warm for quite some time. Another thing you can also do is you can drop a pine cone and light it on fire real quick for some quick warmth. And I think I might actually do that. But only problem is I can't drop a full stack. In fact, I don't think there is a way to break stacks up in this game. There might be, and I just don't know it. Oh, there is. I did not know that. Huh. Well, just to get some quick warmth. Not waste my... St ah, nice thing. Oh, sorry. I need to make a heat stone, too. That's another good item to have for the winter. And it'll keep you a little bit longer in the winter without freezing. And I do believe it gets colder at night, too. So you definitely want to be home near your fire. I'm going to go ahead and on my meatballs. 
yummy. Good bit of sanity. And luckily, the winter hat does count, such as the dapper vest. So it'll keep my sanity up really high, which is really good. I'm gonna burn down probably two or three more trees. And it should get me a grand total of 37, which is good. I don't know if I'm gonna make that many more lo boards, because I don't wanna waste any more logs. I'm gonna get those evil flowers later, because those are needed for nightmare fuel once you create a shadow manipulator. But as I said, I don't need one just yet, so. And I'm, I'm a bit more, oh crap. Really, that's soon? Damn. Okay, well, looks like we're pretty good here. We need to get back to base. I would kill for some tracks right now. I need to be careful, though, because the last thing I need is one of those little buggers popping out and killing me. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. I killed your mom. What are you going to do about it? I'm kind of scared to let these stay out here, but there's nothing I can really do. It's either let them stay or kill them and I don't have the means to do it once I've created my log suit and I'm protected again I will go and kill them but for right now it's just not worth the risk definitely not worth the risk okay I will go ahead and risk some boards for the night I need to break up a pine cone or something hopefully I don't start freezing I'm not in the tier 2 of freezing just yet so I'm okay I need to make a healing cell Heal myself. It's under survival, and it's right here. Takes one spider gland, one rock, and one and two ash. And that restores, I believe, 20 health. 20 health. Awesome. Let's go ahead and put that back in the old chest. Should be able to make it to the last bit. And let's see how this is doing. <clears throat> Excuse me, as you can see, it's starting to go stale, so I'm gonna cook it now. Dum -da -dum -da -dum. How are you doing? Hi. Hi, Flower. How are you doing? Kind of pretty. Okay, I don't have enough silk to do anything right now. Before it becomes daytime, I will go and check my traps. Do I have a spear on me? I do have a spear. Okay. This. I don't want anything but. Right now, I, I literally want nothing but silk. Oh, that helps too. I stand corrected. It's a big help as well. Because that's healing items. I want to pick this up because I need to drop it. But as you can see, it'll actually bump the monster meat's durability up a bit. I'm going to drop that right here. Can we go at night? Please? It does not want to go nighttime, does it? Damn. Oh good, my hand's ready. I need to make a heat stone as well. Shazam about the reload. Okay, so a heat stone is under survival. Last here. An alchemy engine for this bad boy. It takes a lot of rocks, but it's it's definitely worth it. And I can always just make another pickaxe. In fact, I have some opulent items and some gold nuggets, so I don't want to make an opulent item just yet. That would be kind of redundant. I don't need a pitchfork either. I need all the... I need pretty much everything I have on me right now. It's a bit of a shame. I actually need to make more freaking... I'm not sure what I'm looking for. More chests. That's one of the one thing that sucks when you start getting really into it, is you're going to find that you're going to need a lot of chests. Getting low on rocks. I should probably go on uh, an expedition later. Where, where, where are my rocks? There's a rock down there. If I go down there right now, I could kill the McTavish brothers. I think it's right, or the McWar. I don't care. They're like walruses. But if you kill them, they can drop tusk for a walking cane. There's the pig king. I need to go up there too, so I can give him some jerky. But right now, I'm not too too worried about that. And as you can see, my heat stone is starting to glow. When it's yellow like that, it's almost ready. It'll also heat up in your pocket. There you go. Red is perfect. And it's actually... It used to have enough heat to glow. But as you can see, it no longer does that. Nice and toasty hot. Actually, I just realized... When you're in the wintertime like this, and you have a fire set up, do not equip your gear. Do not take it off. Unless you need to keep your sanity. But unless you have two sanity items... Oh, you are not... You are not... No. 
You son of a bitch. You little bastard. Wow, I can't believe this happened. I need to move you over then. So I'm gonna grab my heat stone and we're gonna go out. We're gonna go. We're just gonna go find trees. So up there looks like good. So we're gonna go back to our usual spot, farm more trees, and continue gathering our items. Hopefully, a tree guard doesn't pop up because winter time is especially bad. So, really? Oh, what am I thinking? I was low anyway. And my sanity is good, and I don't want to start freezing to death, so I need to find a co-elephant. And you'll understand why it's called an elephant of sorts, if I can ever find one. Which hopefully I do, so I can show you. Get some seeds. I'm not going to make a trap just yet. I was going to make a winter tra uh, bird trap. For the winter birds. But I'm not really worried about it right now. So I'm not going to get this. Seeds. Honestly, right now, I'm just kind of looking around hoping to find a... I'm just going to chop you down. Your five durability. Pop, pop, pop. Chop, 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 chop. Thank you. That gives me 40 logs. Should tide me over. Honestly, I don't think I've ever done this before. I'm just looking around looking for tracks. Usually, I get lucky and find one before... I get too far. I think the game actually pushes them your direction too. That's right, I need to make a log suit. I'm gonna go ahead and do that now. Put that in my inventory. I mean, let me refarm that too. I just realized that was probably a bad idea not to make one. If a helmet were to have attack, I would be screwed. My helmet does block 80% damage. But at the same time, it's, it's best to have a log suit as well. Then you take almost no damage. Maybe one a hit. And then I've got 130 health. So one damage is not really going to do all that much to me. I keep hearing the ground move. Like I keep hearing f -f 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 in the snow. And I think hounds are about to kill me. It's the hounds of basketball. We're not there because I think those are good hounds. But whatever. I don't want to waste my honey ham just yet, because it does restore a lot, but I might have to. Oh, good berries. I'll tide me over. Also, another good thing once you have enough hounds, or hound teeth, is make teeth traps. Is it teeth traps? Yeah, teeth traps. It's called a tooth trap, but I think plural is teeth traps. Whatever. But the point is, you want to make some teeth traps, because you can put them in between your berry bushes. And whenever those fucking turkeys get summoned, he walks there, goes, and then dies. Oh, damn it, Bobby. Tooth trap, done. You little son of a bitch. I'd waste a blow dart on it, but one time I did, and it didn't kill it. And it didn't stop it either. So I just ransacked my shit and left. So I lost my blow dart, and I lost my barriers. It was not worth it at all. And unfortunately, I have not been able to locate... Any tracks. Which usually does not happen. Also, a fun fact. If you light one of those on fire with a... One of those bastard little gobblers in it. It will turn into ash. I was pretty happy to find that out. I'm so, so, Winter Hat gives you a surprising amount of insulation. Damn. By the way, you can have as much insulation as you want. You will still eventually freeze. If you don't see a heat source. You will freeze. Found that out the hard way. Oh, please give me tracks. I've been good to you. Why are you doing this to me? Uh, oh, well, I might as well head back. That is a shame. I'm, I'm sure one will pop up eventually. And when it does, I have my sleep dart and I got my food ready. Colophants are amazing too, because just like beefalo, they drop a ton of meat. I believe it's eight pieces of meat in a colophant trunk, which can actually be cooked and eaten. Yep, there it goes, starting to freeze. Luckily, it the tears of freezing are slowed exponentially. So, should be good. Okay, should make it back in time. I'm actually going to chop you down. Unless I start freezing, then I'm going to have to light something on fire. Because, yep, going to have to start lighting something on fire. Where's my torch? 
Sorry, guys. It's not my choice. You would burn my fucking logs, you ass. You, sir, are an ass. Okay. An ass, sir. Wow, I actually killed a bird house. Ah, fuck. Get me on fire and shit. Whatever. I need those ashes anyway. Also, if you do not pick up ashes, they will blow away. So make sure you're picking them up. So I said, if you don't, they will blow away. You will lose them. I lost. I had about 25 pieces of ash on me in one of my worlds because I killed a hound. And the hound it was a fire hound, so it exploded and lit everything on fire, which was the monster meat. And it all well, went away because I died to the grew because I dropped all my flowers all my grass and all my twigs so i could not make a thing and i was pissed as you can see i am set right now no it doesn't go there you go in one you go in one of these i know i have more ash huh i guess not i'm actually gonna go ahead and sleep through the night to save my wood since i can i have a honey ham so om nom 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 boop almost full health that's what i got the berries for Touching. Okay, so we're not freezing anymore. We uh, resets here, resets everything. I'm debating if I want to go gather more wood. Still, I'm, I'm good on wood. So I think I want to make some traps. Start gathering some some rabbits. What I should do is equip my helmet and go bust up some of those tier three nests and just to get rid of them. Tier 3 nests are not hard to kill at all. They're, in fact, very easy to kill once you get them to a certain point. So I'm actually going to do that now. I'm going to go fight some Tier 3 nests. I said the easiest way to do it is to make traps. I'm freezing already. That's kind of crazy. Hmm. I don't want to light anything on fire, though. Whatever. I should keep that one warm. Why is it so cold? Never had this problem before. Maybe it's the, the hat's not so good? I don't know. I might just actually make a trap. I make a fire. How much is a fire? Okay, I got plenty of stuff on me. I'm gonna drop this here to let that get bigger. I don't know, just kite them around. These little guys aren't a problem. You don't even need to you don't even need to. Kite one into a trap. Get it going. Drop. Bait. And then go. This winter is especially cold. And as you can see, they will all go for the meat and fall in the traps. Super simple, super effective. Best way to get tier three out of the way. Like I said, I want to get rid of these. I need the silk and I just want to get rid of them. Come on, you little buggers. There's only two of you guys left. Tier three, come on. The last one, aren't you? Look we'll at a spider land. Alright, let's get rid of this bad boy, get some silk. Sorry, I know this takes a while. Okay. Now that that is done, gather up your traps. I really don't want to gather. I don't want to lose these traps. So I'm actually going to leave it right here. Come on. Whatever, bros are stolen. Come on. Got in the flask.
Sabermansky. Go ahead. Go back. I dare you. Okay, my heat stone should be up here and still hot, so that's a very good thing to see. Because I can pick it right up and put it. I don't know if it, if it counts if it's done in your inventory, though. Whatever. I'm still going to pick it up. Hopefully it does count. If not, well then, oh well. What am I going to do? What are you, you going to do? Oh shit. I guess it doesn't matter, does it? It's warm and it should, I think it says it's warm and cuddly when it's like that. Oh well, not a big deal. I got tons of spider glands. I guess as you can see, now that it's cold enough, I will start taking durability damage. I should be okay though. I'm just gonna waste this wool. I don't need it. Beef level makes excellent fires too. Let's see. Okay, I don't I need the dapper with me. I need that dapper gentleman. I'm not going to waste another day. Oh, are you kidding me? You best get the hell out of my town. Tons of silk anyway, so. I got to remember y'all wanted 10 to 20 minute episodes. I'm sorry I kind of dragged these out. I get a bit excited, you know how it is. Okay, I don't need this metal potato thing. I, I literally don't. That is for something that I will not be doing. So I'll probably sleep the night. I don't have anything to build though. I need to set up some traps for tomorrow. Put these in here because I won't be needing you. Unfortunately, I have no vegetables. So I do have these guys though. Well, that's helpful. Not really. Is he gonna just fuel? Really? No fuel? Well, I'm sure we can use this as fuel. Luckily, I have a lot of fuel, just not a lot of anything else. I'm gonna murder Mr. Bun Bun. Sorry, everybody. You no, know, I know, but you're delicious. I wonder what Monster Gurky plus three of these would cook. Let's see. Yeah, hopefully, I can get some good out of it. You know. Also, jerky goes bad much slower than anything in the game. That's why it's good to put it on a drying rack. You can actually dry out small things of meat as well. Ah, meatballs. Can't complain. Nom, 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 nom. Luckily, I have three more or four more rabbits ready to go. My jerky should be good for a while. So once the day hits, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video. So let's just chill and talk. Hello. It's dapper time. As you can all see. Unfortunately, I'm not doing too hot. You son of a bitch! Don't you dare, you son of a bitch! You stop it right now! I don't understand why he's coming so far over. I'll have to go collect some rocks later and block that off. Little oh, bastard. Okay, we got a meat effigy. We're pretty much set for the winter. Like I said, if I could just find a track, shoot it, and kill it, I'd be happy. Because my, my pigskin hat can last. I mean, I can kite. Where is it? I should actually make another one just in case. No, I don't want to do that. Could make some cells, though. I'm pretty sure I got some ash. Nine ash, eight of those. I don't want to waste the rocks, though. Yeah, maybe I do. But I'm, I'm pretty much... I'm set right now, so I just don't want to waste it, you know? Seems kind of stupid. Anyway, day is here. Tomorrow we are going to go look for some tracks, maybe kill some beefalo. Not really sure, but we're definitely going to survive the day. So, welcome to town, every. So fuck. I keep fucking that up. I'm headed to the grave. Welcome to town, everyone.